All right, well, we got some trains. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the layout. All right, well, it feels good to be back. I know I say that often, but I actually was getting into a good habit of running my trains again. And then about a week and a few days ago, I come down here all excited to work and there's no power. Well, long story short, it ended up that we had a little underground fire, I guess you could say, and our our main electric line coming down to the garage here, well, it got shorted out from wetness and all this stuff, and yeah, it wasn't pleasant, so we had to get that replaced, dug up the yard, got that all figured out, and then we had power again, so we could, um, well, let's just say... Shipping out your packages is really fun, but not when I'm in the dark. <laughs> it was very interesting. I had to ship at a certain time of the day. I had to move half my equipment up, so I did have power uh, up to the house. And yeah, it was just crazy. So we got that resolved. Hopefully this week's a lot more calmer. However, it wasn't calm because yesterday we have received a massive amount of Atlas and Bowser. It came the same day. Um, it was about 15 packages from FedEx. It was like 220 pounds of trains, which in HO, that's eh, decently significant. O scale, probably not a big deal. But yeah, it was a ton of stuff. So um, since we're playing catch up here, uh, as you can see, this nice little backdrop full of 40 foot refrigerated containers. Those are from the new Atlas release. Wanted to do a video about them, but, you know, no power. <laughs> Didn't really help things get running. And I'll come onto the screen here for a minute. And we have uh, the N-Scale, a couple N-Scale containers as well. These are 53-footers, but can't go wrong with those bright hub groups. Swift Shield, that's pretty neat, you know. So, so we received them, and... Yesterday, we received a ton of Bowser hoppers and flat cars from Atlas. Bulkhead flats. I know you guys love them, and I, I love them too. They're, they're awesome. And, and don't worry, they're, they're coming down the line here. I'm just prolonging a long intro, so we can, you know, it's kind of like real life. We're waiting for the train to come. It's on its way. It's on its own time, though. <laughs> um, but yeah, we got... Uh, bulkhead flat cars. Uh, some of the flat cars are are, are just uh, shorter flats. Um, even some short bulkhead flat cars. Uh, with yeah, they're in the TTX um, design, and yeah, r really nice stuff. And then even some J89 flat cars. Those things are beasts. And the one that I have, I'll. Yeah, I won't keep you guys in suspense. I broke one of those out to to see with their pipe loads because it just looks awesome. Like I'm used to having to buy a flat car and then buy a, uh, come up with a pipe load or you know buy a fl uh, pipe load from somebody, but no, this thing came right with it, so it's really cool. And we got a ton of them, so uh, after this video, you guys can check out our website. I'll leave a link below in the description to get you guys there faster but so far we have like usual we have pretty good deals on everything i think i think we're probably the lowest on the the longer 89 foot flat cars but you never know the internet's always shifting around but we try to start out with the best deals i mean my wife and i we run the shop really efficiently so we can get away with giving some good deals so you know, whenever we save money, we pass it along to you guys. All right. Well, I hear that BNSF train. It's coming around the bend, so we'll be able to see what we all got. So I'm going to quiet down so you guys can enjoy the train. And uh, anyways, like I said, it was a crazy week. It makes me appreciate you guys all the more because the support we get is just so awesome. It's just so cool to be uh, again, to do a train shop and helping to build your railroads up and, you know, to have a little fun on the rails myself, too. All right. Well, thanks so much for watching. 
and here comes the train.